An East Ridge father is desperate to find his 16 year old daughter. He says she's been missing for nearly a month now. Hannah Lawrence joins us now live with why he's urging police to kick the investigation up a notch. Hannah. Catherine and Josh, for the first few weeks, Allie was considered a runaway because of the way she went missing. Now the TBI is considering her a missing person, but her father says her mental health problems are what worry him most about her well being. Allie Mabry's father says her mother died when she was five. He's had custody of her since, but now he can't find his 16 year old daughter. He says she's been missing since March 4th. It's been like three weeks, three days. I haven't heard one word. The last time he spoke with her was a Saturday night. Hours after he went to bed, the other kids in the house came to tell him about their discovery. That's when he woke me up. Allie's bedroom window was open. Pillows were stuffed under her bed sheets. She was gone. There was a lot of anger at first, you know, I can't believe she did this. When Joshua Mabry reported Allie missing to East Ridge Police, he says officers considered her a runaway. It wasn't until this week that the TBI deemed Allie a missing person. Mabry told officers Allie struggles with mental health problems and they should push harder to find her. Told him, you know, he needs to have a little compassion. This girl's out here, she's got PTSD, ADHD, she's BPD, which is borderline personality disorder. She takes nine different medications. She left them all here. Tonight, he just wants Allie to know this. I love you, Allie. And come home, call me. Please let me know you're safe and alive. I miss you so much. We reached out to the East Ridge Police Department to see if they have any more leads, and we haven't heard back. Josh. Thanks, Hannah. Allie's father believes she may be with a family friend. However, there's nothing from law enforcement to back up that theory. New tonight, Chattanooga Police arrest.